Hi, this is Shubham from Monist View, and today in this podcast we will discuss about a bear put strategy. What are the basic advantages, disadvantages, adjustment, etc. If you want to read the article, then the link of article is in description. Let's start and understand what is a bear put spread strategy. A bear put spread. entails the purchase of an put option and simultaneously sale of another put with the same expiry but lower strike price while it is a conceptually a similar to a buying a stand alone put for speculating on a potential downside or a hedging such risk notable difference is that the sell of a lower price put in a bear put spread offset the part of a cost of a long position and also caps the strategy profit the basic of a bear put spread strategy involve giving up some of a possible profit for lower cost as compared to the stand alone put a bear put spread is also known as a debit spread or a long put spread let's understand what are the key calculation maximum loss would be the net premium outlay plus the commission paid maximum gain would be a difference between the strike price of a put less premium paid break even would be the strike price of a long put less the premium outlay let's understand the different scenario from where we can initiate and profit from bear put spread strategy number 1 scenario would be the moderate downside risk is expected this strategy is ideal when the trader or investor expect a moderate downside in a stock rather than a huge decline in it if the trader expect the stock to plunge stand alone puts would be a preferred strategy in order to derive a maximum profit since the profits are capped in the bear put spread scenario 2 where the risk sought to be a limited as this is a debit spread the strategy's risk is limited to the cost of a spread the bear put spread also has a significant lower degree of risk than a naked short sell third puts are pricey if the puts are relatively expensive typically because of high implied volatility a bear put spread is preferable to buying a stand alone put since the cash inflow from the short put would be defray the price of a long put and the fourth when the leverage is desired for a given amount of investment capital the trader can be more leverage with a bear put spread than the short selling of a stock let's understand what are the different advantages of bear put strategy in a bear put spread as noted earlier the risk is limited to the net premium paid for the position and there is a little risk for position incurring a huge losses there is a situation in which this strategy could accrue a significant losses which would occur if the trader closes the long put position but leaves the short put position open doing so would convert the put spread to a put writing strategy and if the stock subsequently plunges to a price well below the strike price of a short put the trader may be assigned to a stock at a price that is a below its current market price second advantage would be the bear put spread can be a tailor made for a specific risk profile a relatively conservative trader may opt for a narrow spread where the put strike price are not very far apart if the main objective is to minimize the net premium outlay in return for a relatively small gain an aggressive trader may prefer a wide spread to maximize the gain third advantage would be bear put spread strategy has a quantifiable risk reward profile since the maximum possible loss and maximum gains are known our operating margin in margin management would be easily taken care of let's understand what are the disadvantages of bear put spread strategy number 1 the trader runs the risk of losing an entire premium paid for the put spread if the stock does not decline second as the bear put spread is a debit spread at the time is not at the trader side as this strategy only has a finite amount of time before its expiry third there is a possibility of an mismanagement if the stock declines sharply in this case since the short put may be well in the money the trader may be assigned the stock while the long put can be exercised to sell the stock in the event of assignment 
there may be a difference of a two or three days in settling these trades so trading in index would be preferable fourth disadvantage would be since the profit is limited with bear put spread this is not the optional strategy if a stock is expected to decline sharply let's discuss what is the bottom line the bear put spread strategy is a suitable option strategy for making a position with a limited risk on a stock with a moderate downside it's lower level of risk as opposed to shorting the stock as well as a smaller outlay occurred on the standalone puts are a bill characteristic however new option traders should be aware that this rebate strategy the entire amount invested in a bear put spread can be lost if the stock does not decline as anticipated so that's the strategy guys here shubham signing on from monish your but before that if you want to read the article regarding this strategy you can get that from the link is in description thank you